Wag Your Tail is a super fun and active song that explores animals, fast and slow, and action phrases like wag your tail, clap your hands, wiggle your ears, thump your chest, and bend your knees. The simple actions can all be done while standing in one spot, making it a great warm-up song for groups big or small and groups with various skill levels. Stay tuned until after the song to learn some fun activities you can do with Wag Your Tail. Now let's get started. Clap, clap, clap your hands, clap your hands with me. them slow. Clap your hands with me. Wag your tail like a dog. Wag, wag, wag your tail. Wag your tail with me. Wag it back. Wag it slow. Wag your tail with me. Thump your chest like a gorilla. Thump, thump, thump your chest. Thump your chest with me. Thump your chest with me. Bend your knees like a camo. Bend, bend, bend your knees. Bend your knees with me. Bend them fast. Bend them slow. with me. Wiggle your ears like a hippopotamus. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle your ears. Wiggle your ears with me. Wiggle them fast. Wiggle them slow. That was Wag Your Tail. This is a great song to do at the beginning of class to warm up and manage energy levels. It gives students with lots of energy a chance to burn some of it off and also gives students who might be feeling tired a chance to move some energy around. The movements are simple and children love trying to go fast and slow. This is a super fun song for an animal themed lesson but also a great song to introduce or review the words fast and slow. If you are just teaching these words, start off by doing some simple actions, like clapping. Clap fast and say fast. Encourage your students to follow along and repeat after you. Then stop and begin to clap slow and say slow. Go back and forth between fast and slow a few times. Then ask your students to clap fast and slow on their own and see if they understand the concept. Then you'll be ready to sing the song. Ask your students for other movement ideas like jumping or skipping. <laughs> Try doing the actions they come up with fast and then slow. You can also ask for movements related to other animals like stomping for elephants, or hopping for kangaroos. 
For more animal review and movement, use animal flashcards like these from Super Simple and ask your students how each animal moves. Can they come up with a movement for each animal? Have them try doing it fast and then slow. You can also ask them about other things in the world that move fast or slowly. Can they think of any? Try having a list of vocabulary words or flashcards and ask them, does this go fast or slow? Things like a train, a car, a turtle or snail would work really well. And it gives them the opportunity to use even more vocabulary. For a fun game, ask your students to do an action. For example, jumping. When you say fast, they have to jump fast. When you say slow, they have to jump slow. When you say stop, they freeze. Then you can introduce a new action and continue to repeat fast and slow for an active challenge. We hope you enjoy Wag Your Tail. Keep on singing, learning, and having fun. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out supersimple.com for more songs and resources. If you have ideas for how to use this song in the classroom or at home, let us know in the comments. And be sure to subscribe for more teaching tips. Woo!